You are a blabber. One thing I notice to be a nagging consistent habit among many of the aspiring initiates that are seeking freedom from mind enslavement is this addictive tendency for hyper overthinking and then the subsequent non-stop constant yammering about it. Give it a rest, will ya? From where did you get the impression that you should always feel the need to share the contents of your abstraction soup? Just shut up about it already. But wait, you have to understand my position. Stop. How about this? Clear mind, closed mouth. That's a good position. A position that you should invest some time into establishing. It's an honorable position. It's a steadfast position. Clear mind, closed mouth. The more you empty out your mind, the less need you will feel to open up your pie hole. Oh, but I need to speak my mind. Oh, your mind, huh? Yeah. What would we ever do without this speech of your mind? You think it's a good idea that you feel the need to speak your mind. You think you need to. No, you don't. You really don't. Please, be considerate to others for once in your life. And wait till you are alone before you start to engage in vocal flatulence. Do you really think other people want to smell your stinky mouth farts? Uh, get real. And get some help. Because if left untreated, vocal flatulence can quickly lead to verbal diarrhea. Which then becomes a complete disaster for everyone involved. Ah, oh, it's just awful. Yet, you seem to want to prove something. But guess what? No one cares. And do you think anyone is really listening? You should know better by now. People don't listen anymore. They may hear you, but there's no listening going on. You may as well be speaking in tongues. You might just as well be speaking in a strange foreign language. To the hearer is just a bunch of linguistic noise and oral sound effects with no syntax. Kind of like Charlie Brown's teacher. So don't bother. Save your breath. Because it's pretty bad. So that becomes save your bad breath. You can understand that no one wants to smell your bad breath, can't you? Yeah, I know. You want to express your opinion, but same, same. It's still the same thing as saying you want to blow a fart. Hey, newsflash. Your opinion isn't important at all. So get over it. Then why would it be? You're not particularly remarkable. And I know you think you are. So then the question becomes, you are remarkable in comparison to what? To something even lamer than yourself? Wow, that's so lame. In fact, there's nothing more lame than lameness trying to boost its remarkability by contrasting itself against greater lameness. 
That's an even deeper state of lame than the lamer lame, if that makes any sense. Silence is valuable. Silence is potent. Oddly enough, a lot more can be said with complete silence than can be said with a robust cornucopia of complex language. People think words actually mean something. They don't. It's just noise. I know it's cliche, but actions speak louder than words. Never mind what someone says. It's meaningless. Instead, just watch what they do. Words are most often just attempted deceptive redirects. And that's because people think lip service creates reality. It doesn't. And I know you want to project an image and you want people to see you in a certain way. And so you craft your speech accordingly. But you can't mask the truth under a bunch of language. It's paper thin. I will ignore your words and see the plain truth instead. Never mind what you want me to believe and how you want to be seen. Fuck your desired projected image. I will see the plain truth instead. Like I've said before, smoke and mirrors and a hundred thousand words can't make illusion into a reality. Just one sentence of pure truth, on the other hand, has the potential to create entire worlds. And better even still, just one moment of pure silence has the ability to bring a whole universe to absolute stillness. Think about it, Charlie. Clear mind, closed mouth. And that's that. End of the video. Yeah, it's a short video, but so what? Why are any more words required? I think you missed the point of the whole video. I think you may have missed the point of the whole video. Clear mind, closed mouth. You are a blabbermouth!